Look, if you're working in the built environment, what you have to understand is we are all business partners. You may not like the word business partners. You may think that's too cheesy, but whatever you want to think of as the word that describes, we're in this together. Every project must be a success. And at the end of every project, we must want to work with the people we worked with again and again and again. If you're not thinking that way, then what you're going to do is you're going to beat people up on price and blame other people. The problem with that is general contractors is an example. If you beat up your subs, do you know that they have different pricing depending on how reliable the people they work with are? In other words, if your job site management is exquisite, if you understand how to pay people on time, <laughs> subcontractors want to work with you. But if you're somebody that beats everybody up on price, waits the last minute to pay, guess what? Subcontractors only work with you if they don't have better work to perform. We're all in this together. Make sure you are taking care of your partners. And if you're not, your next action is Sit down with those people that are most important to your success in the future and go have a business conversation. That conversation sounds a little bit like this. Hey, we're business partners and we realize our success is linked to your success. How could we be a better partner for you so that you could perform your work, keep your people, be successful in the future, and make a reasonable profit on your investment in time and people? If you don't want to have that conversation, guess what? That conversation will happen without you in the room and your prices, your availability of the best trades is going to be less. Have the conversation today.